Yo, what it comes back here for another episode of Ben 10, season two, episode 13, the finale. Back with vengeance. So I wonder who's showing up. You know, he has multiple villains. Last episode, we just got Animal back. Dr. Animal, my bad. I'm not gonna take that title away from you. And he pulled up with this, you know, mutated monsters. Ben was fidgeting with the watch and a piece fell off. We're lucky it didn't blow up his wrist, to be honest. Animal stole it and then he built some kind of laser, whatever. <laughs> Quick, I know. He was using the piece to power it and it was like mutating humans or whatever. And he's like, let me use this one at the world. He threw away his whole ideals for that trophy. He don't care about that trophy no more. And he is just a true villain now. Ben and with the help of Gwen was able to stop him. It was kind of cool though, because Ben's aliens were like hybrids. There's like two of them combined together because you know the watch was broken. And they were kind of trash to be honest. <laughs> they were weaker than if you just had the one. But yeah, great episode. Thank you guys for clicking this video. I really appreciate it and let's go. Wherever I went in the galaxy, no matter whose butt I kicked. One name kept coming up over and over. Wait, no shot. They team up. Vilgax. Bro, this is like a, a show finale. You're telling me Kevin went to Vilgax and said, hey, let's go jump a 10 year old. Top three hater. Top three hater of all time. He just secured a spot. How can you not admire the beauty and raw power of nature? I don't know. Ask Ben. Would you please pay attention to something other than that watch? I'm just trying to figure out how to control it better. That's all great. I would have just been like, hey, stop messing with it, man. Please. Uh-oh. Please tell me I didn't bust this thing again. Gray matter. Diamond head. Cool. Wait, what? Maybe they did this because he's going to need the help. <laughs> Man's about to get jumped. Poor man. No problem. Did Ben just go right from Rip Jaws into Exactly, he's broken now. He can do it all. You don't look so tough. Living him out of the ice, then, buddy. Never mind. Maybe they don't work together. I don't know. Those guys might have too much of an ego. You should be grateful. Vilgax owes allegiance to no one, especially not some misshapen, chaotic amalgam of creatures. You may be of some use to me after all. You took the words right out of my mouth, pretty boy. <laughs> Bro, that was the only edible food all summer. He's gone too far. This guy's an Uber. I thought I'd say this, but I'd rather see your normal jerky face for a change. I will take it easy. For a millisecond. Time's up. Never mind, I hate that kid. Now when do I merge my fist with Ben's face? Jesus, the hate. I don't like to see out of you. Top three, top three. Listen up, Phil Geek. I don't take orders, and I could care less about some stupid watch. I just want revenge on the little twerp wearing it. Patience. We can only track him when the Omnitrix is in use. Oh. That can Shit! Okay, finally for the action. And we know all his secrets. Bill Gax, you're alive. And about to kick your butt. Never figured you were the type to take on an apprentice, Bill Gax. Never tell me what. Hey! Where'd Tennyson go? This man, Ben, doing a hero work. You can't beat them both. 
Together, they're too powerful. Yeah, they, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, yeah. I'm bent at. He sounds pretty confident. I stashed something away in here that should take care of both Vilgax and Kevin. For good? Hey, oh, 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 oh. Voice projector? The old man and the girl are the key. Once we have them, the boy will come to us. Oh, we're good. But then Ben had to be an idiot. Where are we? The null void. An alternate dimension where the galaxy's worst of the worst are banished. No! What was that all about? Respect. I'm going in after Ben. Shouldn't you be putting your plumber suit on? I'll go. No, it's too dangerous. Thank it's you. It's our best chance of getting Ben out of there, Grandpa, and you know it. That's what I'm saying. They gave Gwen the fit. Once this gauge hits the red zone, you need to get out, no matter what. Now I think about it. Anything that's not Grandpa and Max, you could have went. You telling me the, the thing's on a timer? She could just sit there and watch the timer. <laughs> Said, well, damn. <laughs> Let her go, and you can have the stupid on the tricks. Ben, no. <laughs> Wait, he's just like me now, a human. I Oh. oh. But who says you're forgetting? That's what I'm saying. Oh. No way, a double cross? I told you, Kevin Eleven don't take orders from nobody. Go where? That's your miserable dimension. You live there too, huh? Kevin, you are straight trash. I was cocky and totally abused my powers. And I'm sorry. Guess that won't happen again, since I'm back to being just plain old Ben. Okay, maybe I'll just keep it for myself. Wait, what? Oh, the Omnitrix! Omnitrix is mine! Oh. Uh. At that point, there is no level, like, you have to wipe out the bloodline. Ben's parents are getting it. Gwen's parents are getting it. <laughs> yeah, they had to go that hard. Maybe a face full of stink fly goop, or a tangle of wild vine tendrils. Or Gray matter. Thank the Lord is broken again. There are only like 999 million more combinations for you to try. 
That's it! You are so dead! <laughs> <sighs> this finale was a banger. I'm gonna... I mean, might be the best episode of this season. M both seasons combined. Who would have thought we actually saw the matchup of the year? Ben 10 versus not one, but two supreme villains like best known in the galaxy kevin 11 and vilgax at the same time like oh my god even in my wildest dream i never even thought of that matchup because i'm like there's polar opposites they'll never work together kevin 11 is an idiotic kid <laughs> and then vilgax is like a, a dictator i don't know conquer a world like he doesn't want to work with anybody you no know, one wants to get the job done by himself and then Kevin, hard-headed, he doesn't want to work with anybody, he doesn't want to listen to nobody, he, you know, he's that kind of kid. But they somehow teamed up and still lost, they got whooped. I did see the, the double cross coming, because it's like, knowing their personalities, come on. <laughs> it was bound to happen. I wouldn't even turn my back to somebody named Kevin. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so, Gwen, big ups. Grandpa Max, uh, I understand you had to hit some buttons on the, the projector to keep it going. Other than that, why couldn't Gwen be out there? Be like, hey, Gwen, just use the frontal... Push the first number and then the second number, put in the code 43789, it'll keep the port open two more minutes or so. But you're like, no, nah, you can go in there, Gwen. <laughs> I'll stay out here. Like, ah, oh, we could have for sure thought of a better way to do this, right? Because especially since they had communication going out, I didn't know they're going to have communication going out. Huh? They can just communicate across dimensions? The no void might be escapable. I'm just saying, because if you can get signal out, for sure you can get like your body out. Like, I don't know, like, atomize it and then reatomize it and I, I don't know sounds impossible but these guys are geniuses or well, at least vilgax so we're probably gonna see him again kevin obviously because this hate he might just get off of hate alone you know he he would hate ben so hard that it just teleports them to earth <laughs> i don't know man like top three haters of all time i'm telling you right now the master controls thank the lord they're locked out ben doesn't deserve the master controls he's a kid like it let him at least like 16 or 15 and then we might give him half the controls wait like, come on now but great episode thanks for watching we'll do appreciate catch you guys next time for another video peace peace bye bye have a great day Got